Oh ho, it's about frickin' time we played Skullgirls. I've been dying to hop on this game again. Yes, 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 I'm gonna be the ultimate Skullgirl. Not on my watch, you prehistoric dust collector. The Big D already has his sights on being the ultimate Skullgirl. Oh, screw the hell off, you sunburnt Teletubby. I wanna be the Skullgirl. L-M-A-O. Imagine listening to two 80-year-olds fighting over who has a bigger vagina. At least I'm not a black guy named Barack Obama. Okay, so what? What's wrong with that? Don't make me go off on you. What? All right. All right. If y'all are done with your makeout session, who's going to be the first one to bow down to Batty Biden? Who are you trying to convince with that wild statement, Sleepy Joe? I remember when Obama and I used to always kick your butt in this game. Uh, first of all, I don't remember you guys ever beating me in this game. And also, I've been practicing my philia combos, so you better watch what you say, Orange Man. That's probably because your senile crack is riddled with dementia. But that's okay, because I will humbly remind you who's the boss around here. All right, well, before y'all decide who has the bigger vagina, I think we need to have a moment of silence for the character select music. Oh, yes. My kings and queens, you must listen to this character select song. It is absolutely a bop, believe me. Oh, it's been too long since I've heard this banger? Preach my brotha. This is one of those themes that get the Trump stamp of approval. Now that I'm officially fired up and ready to go, I'm going to pick my main girl, Philia. I expect nothing less from the sloppiest of Joes, like we all knew you were going to pick the teenager. Get off my sack, you orangutan. Her age has nothing to do with my decision, though it is a plus. What? I actually picked her because Samson is a certified badass. Yeah, I'll admit, Samson is pretty cool, but he and Philly are no match for my girl, Peacock. <laughs> Did you say Peacock? Well, guess what? I'm going to pee in your cock if you don't lock in already. Pause! I see what you were trying to do there, Joe, but that just sounded sus as hell. Yeah, Joe, you're pretty bad at roasting. So please, for the love of Mermaid Man, don't ever say that sus shit to me again. Donald's just mad because he can't get the hose like I do. Ah, ha, ha, ha. The only hose you're attracting are the corpses at the cemetery. Now shut your wrinkly mouth and pick a stage. Yeah, Joe, on the real though, I hope you've been legit grinding because last time you just spammed random buttons and that shit was light work for me. Y'all will be eating your words just like how Jill eats my ass every night. Ain't nobody ready for me in Philly. TMI Biden, but who cares? It's showtime pussies. So are we going to make any bets or anything today? I don't know. Do y'all want to put some money on this? Like the winner takes all the cash? I'm thinking a small loan of million dollars is a reasonable deal. Yeah, that works with me. What about you, Joe? Yeah, I wouldn't mind taking some cash from this talking Big Mac. Not like this dude pays his taxes anyways. Well, I hope you have your bank on speed dial, Toadsworth. Because you basically just signed a death wish taking this bet. Score one for the Trumpster pussies. Oh, piss off. Make sure you're taking notes on me, Barack, because me and you both know that I'm your biggest threat here. Well, you definitely are the biggest one here, but I wouldn't say you're a threat. Oh, shut the fuck up already, Sleepy Joe. You're just a button masher who has no clue what he's doing anyways. Yeah, Joe, you're literally getting your ass handed to you right now. I thought you said you learned the philia combos. Oh, give me a break. The combos in this game are hard as hell, and it's been a while since I've played. Your crippling dementia sure doesn't help either. But worry no more, Father Time, because I'm about to send you back to the retirement home. Ah, ah ha, damn ha, it. Ha. What the hell? That was probably the saddest match I've ever seen. I mean, I expected Donald to win, but I was hoping JoJo would put up a better fight. LOL, Sleepy Joe, not even your button mashing can save you from my trump card, pussy. 
<laughs> uh, screw you, Donald, and talk. Why can't you guys just let me be the ultimate skull girl? The hell wrong with you? If you want to be a skull girl, then you need to earn it, Jojo. Oh, don't worry. I will most definitely earn it because I'm going with my backup girl, the hot babe herself, Pain Wheel. Pain Wheel. <sighs> L M A O. Ain't no way you just called Pain Wheel a hot babe. It seems like your eyes really have gone extinct. Am I right, Dump Truck Donald? I got two words for you, Abunga. Michael. Fuck you, that's not even two words, and my wife is a shoddy no cap. Anyways, I'm more of a cerebella main, but I'll save that for Donald, so I'll beat you with Ms. Fortune instead. <laughs> Everyone's gang gang until the woman starts throwing her head at you. I'm about to give you some head if you don't shut the hell up already. Biden, you seriously need to chill out with the sus comments. Bruh, what did I even say? O-M-F-A-O, bruh, I swear you do this shit on purpose, don't you? Do what on purpose? Nothing, Batty Biden, just have your cash app ready, because your boy is coming for that cash prize. Wow, Joe, I'm impressed on how well you've done so far. What do you mean, so far? The match barely just started. Exactly. I'm impressed that you were actually able to get a hit on me, LMAO. Ahahaha. Ah, Ahahaha. You got the whole squad laughing with that one pussy. What the hell was that goofy ah laugh you just did? And the only thing the squad would be laughing at right now are your terrible skills at this game. Keep running that mouth, because y'all are just mad that I'm about to prove all the haters wrong and become the greatest skull girl ever. Mojo Jojo, can you knock it off with the I want to be a skull girl mumbo jumbo? No, I will never knock it off. Never. Take this Biden. Ah, damn you, Barrack. Uh, you were saying Biden? Screw you, it's not over yet. I'm going to tell you exactly what I told Jill this morning, and that's that I want to be the ultimate skull girl when I grow up. What on earth does that even mean? And what do you mean when I grow up? You're like 500 years old. You've been grown up since the freaking ice age, you fossil. Honestly, Joey, it sounds like you're taking this game a little too seriously, which is funny because you're not even good at it, Lumpa. Less talking and more fighting. Ha 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 ha, don't celebrate too early, Obunga. Wow, Joe, I'll admit I didn't expect you to take Obama to the third round. It seems like I was unfamiliar with your game. Don't start making out with his butt cheeks just yet because I'm going easy on him. But don't get it mistaken, I ain't handing out free wins this time, Demantia Daddy. Ah ha ha ha. Get used to calling me Daddy, because I'm about to put you down just like how I did with Michelle last night. Hey, hey, hey! That's too far, Batty Biden. Wah! Obama, don't ever make that goofy ah sound again, or I will spank you harder than Michael. And as for you, Joe, I'll admit your gaming skills are getting slightly better but your roasts are still weak as hell. Don't care, plus didn't ask. L plus ratio, suck my dick, you diabetic Cheeto. Fix your fucking mic before you L plus ratio me, you feral ghoul. <laughs> Sounds like I beat him so hard that it fucked up his mic. <laughs> no, 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 this wasn't supposed to happen. Wah, ah, you guys cheated. Wah. Biden, what the hell was that? Oh, shoot, sorry. My mic is acting up again. Man, technology these days. Anyways, what I meant to say was, no, this wasn't supposed to happen. Wah, ah, ha. Oh, stop it, Biden, stop it. You lost fair and square now, accept it. No, no, no. You guys cheated, damn it. I want to be a skull girl. Let me be a skull girl. Shut your wrinkly mouth, you fossil. Maybe if you actually learned some combos instead of button mashing, then you probably would have won. Yo, what's good, homies? I thought I heard some little girls screaming. LMAO, bro thinks he's Joe Biden. Yo, is this Skull Girl second encore? Man, I remember pulling out some mean combos on this back in the day. Y'all gotta let me join in. You know what? Perfect timing, Georgina. Hey, Biden, you can 1v1 him and finally get a win today. True, true, like this is George we're talking about here. I mean, you seriously have to be pretty bad if you actually lose to George. To be honest, Georgina is easy light work, so I don't think beating him is going to make me feel better. I swear the dubia disrespect is atrocious. Y'all are just unfamiliar with my game. Hey, kings and queens, can your boy get a cowboy emoji up in this hoe? Ah, uh, hell no, not in my house, you plain flying hillbilly. 
The only emojis you will see are the plain emojis because you're a no good Jenga destroyer. Yeah, and you can gargle my nutsack, you goombe. All right, fine. I guess I'll tussle with the dubia. My dear Philia and Samson can use a win right now. I'm not even surprised that you mean Philia. Man, it, it must be. Let me guess. You're gonna say, oh, Joey likes children and that's why he picked her. <laughs> You're not funny, bro. Actually, I was gonna say it's because Samson is a certified badass. But sure, be a dick about it, I guess. Anyways, I'm thinking of picking Beowulf. George, if you pick Beowulf, you're gay. Fine, whatever. Then I guess I'll go with Valentine. Homegirl is bad as hell, no cap. All right, Biden, how about this? If you beat George, you can keep the money, but if you lose, then you're paying both me and Donald. That's a deal I'll take, because ain't no way I'm losing to this Texas bastard. I will continue my journey on becoming the best skull girl ever. Guess we'll see about that Sleepy Joe. Ah ha 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 ha. Shut up, George. The Sleep Joe shtick is my thing. Bruh, I swear I can never win with you guys. It's showtime, pussies. Make it flashy, guys. Action. All right, Joe. I'm rooting for you to take this home. Don't let me down, homie. Best believe I'm about to cook up this it's high noon looking mother trucker. On my mama, y'all underestimate the W2 way too much. Holy cow tits, I ain't gonna cap. George is kind of cooking Biden right now. Quit sucking his ding dong. The match barely started. The Biden blast needs some time to charge up. Mojo Jojo, you're more likely to shit your diaper before you let out your goofy ah Biden blast. And you're more likely to fly a plane into another tower than you are to be invited to one of our game plays, you hillbilly. On Barnacle Boy, I will kick your guys' asses if you make one more plane joke. Actually, better yet, I will fly a plane straight into your house. Bruh. Mr. Bush, you gotta be one dumb son of a bitch. Like how the frick are you gonna tell us to stop making plane jokes and then follow it up by saying, I'm gonna fly a plane into your house. L plus ratio pussy. Yeah, not gonna lie, that was dumb as fuck, George. I ain't gonna cap, I did indeed walk into that one, so I'll take the L on that. But something I won't take the L in is this absolute ass whooping I'm giving Joe. Okay, but in Joe's defense, you've spammed the same move like four times already. Like this ain't even impressive anymore. Oh, give me a break. It's difficult to pull off. George, ain't no way you just did that same freaking move again. My controller must be broken or something. I swear I was trying to do something completely different. At this rate, George, I'm going to make you pay Barack and I, even if you beat Joe. Well, he may need to pay all three of us because I ain't throwing in the diaper just yet, fellas. Bro said that as he just missed his special move, LOL. Oh, that was just a fluke. Watch, I got another trick up my sleeve. All right, Joey, I'll give you that one. That was clean as hell. That shit was just as clean as Joe's diapers after a trip to Taco Bell. Bro looked like he was panicking and just starting spamming random buttons like usual. Man, if George actually manages to fumble this, like for real, I will be laughing hard as hell. The only person who will be laughing is me, because your boy ain't choking tonight. Not today, honey. No, no, no. This game is rigged. I hate you all. That's it. I've had it. Jill, get over here. Oh my God, Jill, no. Oh, stop it. Jill and her senile butt crack of a husband can kiss my hairy ass. Joe sucks at this game, and now that he's gone, me and you can finally settle this obunga. Damn straight. Hope you got that cash app ready, homeboy. Wait, what about me? Am I not in this bet anymore? Bush, you were never in this bet. We just let you play so we can laugh at Joe. LMAO, I'm dead. Oh, well, I guess I'll just watch. I got my money on Barrack. Smart choice, because I'm picking my main girl, Sarah Bella. Don't care, plus didn't ask. Anyways, I'm picking Parasol because she's hot. And why the hell not, am I right? All right, it's showtime, ladies. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. Take this, Tubby. Nah, Barack, I should have said this at the beginning of the video. 
But I think I speak for everyone when I say you look goofy with that shit on your head. Screw off bubble bath. I'll have you know, Michelle said I looked sexy with this on my head. Yeah, and Michelle is also the manliest of man. So I don't expect her to have good taste in style. Oh, hell no, you sack of horse shit. Oh, Barack, that was one filthy move right there. Fake news, that move was nothing special. Are you sure about that, Don Don? Because it looks like I'm cooking you up right now. Nah, 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 the big D ain't gonna fold. How the hell did I already die? I was barely at 60%. This game is rigged. Oh! What on earth was that? Looks like the Obaminator draws first blood. And it sounds like Donald just pooped his pants. Ha! Oh, shut the fuck up already, George. Nobody asked you to be the fucking commentator. You better keep your eyes on me, orange man, because soon enough you're going to end up giving me that small loan of a million dollars. Oh, hell no. The great Don ain't one to give to charity. I'm about to make one of the greatest comebacks. It's going to be huge. Believe me. Oh, shoot, I might actually fold here. <laughs> Bring me my money, you orange pig. Hey, guys, I'm back and I got something to say. Wait, what the fuck? Joe, unpause the game. No! I told you guys I want to be a skull girl. Oh, for the love of God, would you shut the fuck up already with the skull girl crap? You're not going to turn into a girl now, unpause the game. No, no, no. I'm not unpausing until I get my wish. I'm going to become a skull girl. Rawr! Joe, I swear you better not shit your pants. Rawr! What incarnation is going on with this dude? Joe, stop making those weird noises and unpause the game. Joe, you're not going to become a girl. Stop it already. What the hell? Holy shit! What just happened? Ah. Ah, ha, 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 yes, yes, I've finally become a skull girl. No, 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 what the flip just happened? I just became a girl, a real girl. Ha, 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 Now you pussies will bow down to me. Ah! Ah! Where the frick are we? What is happening? You cockheads are in my house now. <sighs> Fake news! Fake news! I don't know what's happening, but I ain't going down without a fight. Nah, 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 Joe. You got some explaining to do. What did you just do? I already told you a billion times, Abunga. I said I wanted to be a skull girl. And now the universe has finally granted my wish. There is no way you're an actual girl right now. There's just no way. Believe it, Obamna! This is reality! And this is who I am now! Oh, piss off, sloppy Joe! You are not a girl. You are and will always be a senile old fart. And you will always be a fat orange blob, you dickhead. Now die. Ah! Jesus Christ, y'all are crazy as hell. I should have never joined you idiots. Oh, don't worry, George, because I got one last middle finger for you, buddy. What do you mean by that? Wait, what the flip? Jojo, this is insane. Stop this madness right now. I will never stop. Obama, y'all were talking trash, and now I'm going to prove to everyone that I am the ultimate skull girl. Ah ha ha ha. Joe, I don't know what kind of pills you've been taking, but you can't actually be serious about this. You think I want to be a wrinkly old fart Obama? Because I don't. This is what I want. Now perish. Ah! <laughs> yes, I won. Suck my hairy ball sack, you losers. <laughs> what just happened? I have no clue, but I'm going to make out with Melania. Screw that fossil and screw this game. No, no, no. I can't let our president run around looking like a little girl. Looks like I'm going to need to get some backup. Obama mama, how's it going with you? It's been absolutely booty cheeks, Liza. Thank goodness you showed up. 
Jojo has been out of control lately. Yeah, I was shocked when you first told me, but I still can't believe that snotty piece of horse shite actually turned into a girl. Like, doesn't he know? I'm supposed to be the female president around here. Me! Exactly! Exactly! It's ridiculous! We can't allow our president to walk around like that. You're darn right we can't. Now where's Big Chungus? I thought he said he was joining. <laughs> What's up, my Gs? I'm gonna get straight to the point. Where is that senile bastard? Yeah, I'm dying to get my hands on that sleeping beauty. He hasn't been answering my calls, but don't worry. I have the perfect plan on how we can summon him into this call. And what exactly is this genius plan of yours? Don't worry, I'm inviting someone right now. Hello, Obama. I joined just like you asked. What the hell? Oh my god, no way you're you. Obama, you disgusting mongrel. Why the hell did you invite a little girl into our call? Wow, Obama, I didn't know you were down this bad. Oh, come on. How else am I supposed to summon Sloppy Joe? Ha <laughs> ha. Um, Mr. Obama, um, why is there a drone hovering over my house? Don't worry, sweetie. It'll all be over soon. What do you mean it will all be over soon? What are you gonna do to her? Yo, yo, yo! What is good, my homies? Y'all didn't tell me you were inviting some friends today. Ha, 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 ha! It worked. Sorry, little girl, but you are no longer needed. Oh my god, no, a bonga. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you, Mojo Jojo? Just look at yourself. Yeah, I look great. Way better than that orange roadhog cosplayer over there. Suck a dick, Sleepy Joe. I look great, very great, and you know it. But you, on the other hand, all I see is a bunch of fake news. Nah, nah, nah. This right here is real news. Real news. I can even show you my huge Dehunka Pankaloos to prove it. Oh, hell no. Keep your darn shirt on! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Y'all just gotta accept the fact that I will be the greatest female leader ever. Oh, hell to the no! I'm supposed to be the female president here! Me! Ha 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 ha! Not anymore, Lady Liza! That title belongs to me now! Ha ha ha! Look, I don't know who spiked your dementia pills or how you even turned into a girl, but that doesn't change the fact that I'm the real woman here! And if I have to beat the woman out of you, then I will! Ha <laughs> ha! Ain't nobody beating the great female Biden. Give me your best shot, homegirl. Oh ho, you underestimate me, Biden. I am a god at Skullgirls. Like the game is literally called Skullgirls. It was made for someone like me. Well, you're not as good as the big D Trump, of course, but that's besides the point. Prepare to lose Sloppy Joe. Wait, wait, no, wait. I don't, I want to play Skullgirls. Let's play something else. Bruh. Bro, what? Ain't no way you're backing out. You started this, Joe. Nah, nah, nah. This isn't fair. Liza is literally girl, so she's obviously goaded at Skullgirls. Well, you should have thought about that before you decided to grow a vagina. Now hurry up and face me in battle. No, I'm not sacrificing this body unless we play something else. You got to play by my rules. Fine. Whatever, Joe. But if we beat you in this other game of yours, then you have to turn yourself back to normal. All right, deal. Because I know I'm going to win in this game. Y'all ain't ready for this. Ha 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 ha! Pokemon Coliseum, ha ha! Joe, you're the worst Pokemon trainer I know. This will be cake! Ha <laughs> ha, you underestimate me, Obama Mama. I'm one of the most feared trainers in the Pokemon region. The only people who fear you are the children at the local playground. Eat my ass, Trump. You wish you musky dust collector. I hate to be the party pooper, but what the heck is on your head, Obama? Piss off. This is the only Pokemon hat that fit my head. Plus, Michelle bought this for me, so I have to wear it. You're telling me the man with the plan couldn't find a bigger hat? Can't she just use her muscular arms to stretch out the hat? Ha ha ha! <laughs> You're walking on thin ice, Snorlax. All right, all right. If y'all are done with your makeout session, who's going to be the first one to bow down to Batty Biden? Who are you trying to convince with that wild statement, Sleepy Joe? I remember when Obama and I used to always kick your butt in this game. I will be taking on Joe Mama. Ah ha ha, you ain't ready for me, Biden. Oh, hell to the no! Stand back, loser Liza. Let the big D-Don handle. Shut the handle. fuck up, Hariyama! 
Ain't nobody trying to see your mill tank titties jiggling all over the battlefield. Obama called me for a reason, and it's cause your goofy ah couldn't get the job done. So now I gotta clutch up for y'all. LMFAO, you're supposed to be cooking Sleepy Joe, not Trumpy. Ha <laughs> ha! Anyways, let's do double battles. Whoa! Are y'all playing Pokemon Coliseum? Oh, don't tell me. Is that the main man himself? Motherfucking Reggie Rock. I don't know where he came from, but I kicked his goofy. Ah, uh, you wee! All right, I think this lineup is pretty cool if I do say so myself. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, I'm quite the expert at this game, and I know a strategy we can go with. Hold your horses, Nerd Bama. Keep your sweaty strats to yourself, because I'm going to pick the Pokemon that I think look the coolest. So you're not going in with any type of plan? No, I'm not. I think it's more fun when you use the ones that look the coolest. It's all about swag. Plus, I'm not that educated in Pokemon, so I'll just wing it and hope for the best. Jesus Christ, yeah, we're doomed at this point. Well, you can't spell Liza without the L, ha ha ha. Wait, no, that's not what I meant. Let's see if y'all can hang with Batty Biden. Ha ha ha! Come to me, Machoke and Pikachu. Sorry, Josefina, but you're dealing with the best of the best. Behold my beauties! Let's go, Masquerade and Maywild. <clears throat> well, I'm liking my odds right now. At this rate, I'm never switching back. Why do you even like looking like a little girl, Joe? You were totally fine just the way you were. All right, Barack, let's not lie to the man. Like, we all know you were capping with that statement. Well, according to Trump and like 90% of the internet, they didn't like the old me. I can't tell you how tired I was of being called a sleepy senile fossil. You're always tired, you old fart. And no matter what you look like, you will always be a wrinkly, senile, dementia-ridden dinosaur. Ha 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 ha! Well, actually, that roast doesn't even make sense anymore because your boy is now a beautiful young girl. Which means you're the only wrinkly fossil here. Ah ha ha ha. L plus ratio bitch. Kiss my left, nut you pussy. Unlike you, I actually look great for my age. Some may say I look the best, the very best. That is cap and you know it. Your ugly ass probably talks to yourself in the mirror. You're damn right I talk to myself in the mirror. Every morning I wake up and I go to my gold-plated mirror. Say Donald J. Trump. You are the sexiest man live. The sexiest. Believe me. And don't let that dementia-ridden son of a bitch tell you otherwise. Piss off, you Teletubby. I'll have you know, ever since I became a girl, all the youngsters have been dying to get my number. The people love me. That is no flex, Sloppy Joe. You see, some of us don't need to change our whole persona just to get the hose. In other words, skill issue. Skill issue this foot up your ass. You acting like you don't look like a hentai character. Wow, Joe, that roast was weaker than your Pokemon, LMAO! And I'll have you know, I attract kings and queens! Are you talking about those goofy friends of yours? You mean Carijo and Yenna? Nah, not those goofballs. I mean, I'm sure they love me and absolutely miss me right now, but that's besides the point. I'm talking about true kings and queens. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna give them a shout-out. Oh, yeah! What the hell was that? Sorry, it's just that Maywile took a mean hit. Ah, ha, ha. Anyways, back to the kings and queens. Shout out to Winter Blue Inc., Kevin Bolanos, Luis El Crusader, Trix the Anime Hata. Thanks for becoming awesome members. Let's go. I hope I said those correctly. You know, members get special perks like custom emojis, cool badges, early access to videos, special polls, sneak peeks, and all that good stuff. Link in description. Hey, hey, can I become a member? Screw you, Joe. Turn back into a feral ghoul and then we can start negotiating. Eat my cheeks, you hippopotamus. I ain't trading these huge babies. Biden, I will give you the nastiest purple nurple you've ever All right, seen. settle down. Let's focus up on the battle, yeah? Yes, and allow me to explain my strat. As you can see, Maywile has been increasing her attack and defense, and I'm about to let out a sick baton pass. It will go to Hipmon Top. Home Dog is gonna be a total machine, ha ha ha. Um, I, I ain't scared. No, I ain't scared. Wait, what's a Pokemon? Funny how this dude changed his whole gender, and yet his dementia still followed him. L plus ratio pussy. Don't 
Don't worry, Batty Biden. I will humbly snap your machoke back into reality. <laughs> oh, and shout out to my boy Jimbo. Can't forget Jimbo. That man is real news, let me tell you. Bro, really joined in the middle of the video. L-M-A-O. Aha, uh -huh, he survived. Let's go. Ahaha, uh -huh, not in my house. Sam, your mommy. Now I'm about to get my get back. <laughs> Biden, don't ever make that sexy noise again or I will slap you with your own titties. Now my croconaut is about to avenge him. <laughs> well played, Batty Biden. But I'm going to bring May Weil back in and do the same strat for my grand bull. Well, Liza, I must say, I am impressed with what you've come up with so far. Even though I do think it's kind of mid, but that's me. Well, I don't care, Humpty Dumpty. Plus, I didn't ask. So take this L just like JoJo. You know, Donald, being a girl is actually cooler than you think. Maybe you should join me. Yeah, right, Josefina. I like being able to walk at night without having to check my surroundings every five seconds. Plus, I don't have to worry about becoming pregnant. To be honest, you already look pregnant with triplets, so I don't see what's the difference. Screw you, <laughs> Biden. Just you wait until we meet up in person. I'm going to give you that classic Trump one-two punch. Go ahead and try. I may be a girl, but I still got that ultra-mega Biden blast in my pocket. What exactly do you even do as a girl, Joey? I'm glad you asked, actually. Uh, ha, ha. Oh, well, you know, my favorite part is when I go to the gym and head to the women's locker room. Oh, it is fantastic in there. Let me tell you. Biden, you are so gross. I swear, the moment I see you in public and I'm crushing your skull with my Liza leg drop. Yeah! All right, just for that threat, I'm taking out May Weil. Ha, 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 ha. No, man, May Weil was my favorite. Whatever, you're going to regret doing that, Biden. I'm about to bring in a dog who's even more vicious than Commander. Let's go, Grand Bull. Speaking of Commander, how did he react when he first saw you, Batty Biden? Oh, you won't believe it. That damn dog attacked me and almost bit all my limbs off. But luckily for me, I gave that mutt the good old Biden blast and squirted his eyes with milk. Though I won't tell you where I got the milk from. Oh, I, ah, holy shizza, that was so close. Ooh, yeah. That's my hit on top, coming in clutch. Ah, yeah. Nah, that was just luck. Watch, I'm about to end him right now. By the way, Biden, you did not need to mention that milk thing earlier. Shut up, Abunga. You're just mad because I'm more of a woman than Michael. That's facts, but you're not that much of a shaw to yourself, Biden. Sure, you may look like a chick. But the moment you open your mouth, you just sound like a wrinkly ball sack with awful takes. Rah! This is why I hate you, Trump. Not on my watch, I'm about to clutch up again. If Hitmontop lives this round, I will make out with Obama. Wait, no! Wait, no! <laughs> Let's freaking go! You better get. Ready, you boong! Ah ha! Stay the hell away from me, you sunburned Snorlax! Ah! Your makeout session aside, I'm about to clutch up a second time. Ah ha ha! Oh shoot! Ha ha ha! Down goes the fidget spinner. Looks like Batty Biden is gonna live to see another day. Bro, really took Batty Biden literally. L M A O. Well, joke's on you, because I'm turning this into a one-volt one. Aha! In your face, Shoddy Joe! Ha 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 ha! Shoddy Joe? Now I actually like the sound of that. Damn it, Liza, don't give him any ideas. You still sound like a zombie, though, LMFAO. This is why I want to look like a little girl. Because I like sniffing my own hair, but that's besides the point. It's because people like you are so mean to me. Okay, but becoming old is normal, Jojo. It's the circle of life. If it makes you feel better, Donald is ugly too, and he's wrinkly as hell. Screw you, Abunga. Well, I don't give a damn, but the circle of life mumbo jumbo. I like being young again, and now I'm one with the youngsters. Not in my house, you prehistoric dinosaur. The almighty Liza is ending this now. Ha <laughs> ha. No, 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 no. This can't be. Pikachu, please don't leave me. No. Ha ha ha, it's the end of the line for you, Shoddy Joe. A deal is a deal. No more booby milk for you. Please, Joey, for the love of God, please turn back into an old timer.
We just want the old... All right, all right, fine. I must say I'm going to miss these luscious locks and the ability to go into women bathrooms. Then again, I'm the president, so I can do that anyways. Just because you're the president doesn't mean you can do that. Jesus! Let's just hurry this up. Come on, Joe. A deal is a deal. Hurry it up. Well, oh, there's just one problem. Joe, you can't be serious. You made a deal. What's the problem? I know, I know, but, um, well, it's just that I, uh, I don't think he's going to like it. Who's he, Jojo? Who are you talking about? Wait, what the freak is happening? Mojo Jojo, what is this? Oh, God, he's coming. He's coming. Guys, please help me. What are you talking about, Joe? What is going on? Ah, motherfucker! Oh, oh my God! Ah, help me! Ah! <laughs> it's me, Dark Brandon, bitches. Dark Brandon? Oh, hell no. I thought you were a meth. Think again, fatty. I've been inside Joey ever since he turned into a girl. My dear Sleepy Joe loves being one with the little girls and you idiots aren't going to ruin that for him. Not on my watch. For fuck's sake, Dark Brandon, or whoever the hell you are, we need our Sleepy Joe back. Give him back. Hell no, Obunga. I've been waiting for this moment since the Ice Age. Now I finally got my wish. You're not gonna ruin this. If you want him back, then you have to catch me. <laughs> Peace, bitches! Did he just leave? What do we do now? Don't worry, that dumbass is most likely at the White House. Come on, guys, let's head straight over there and beat the shit out of that stupid motherfucker. Trump is right. We have to get there before Dark Brandon takes full control. Holy shit. How are we supposed to get past all that? This is ridiculous. Look at him doing all of this just to take out the big D Don. I'll admit, that stupid idiot is smarter than I thought. Don't worry, fellas. I brought my dear Lexi. She can take on this whole army no problem. It's true. I even brought my favorite Chinese bazooka just for this special occasion. Did someone say China? No, no, no. Liza and Lexi. These are our citizens you're talking about. What kind of leaders would we be if we let you gun them down? Oh, come on, Obama. This is the easier way. Your girl loves violence, and I'm about to prove that no one can contain the almighty Liza. Ha ha ha! Stop it, Liza. Stop it. We're going to find another way. And how exactly are we going to find a way to get in there? Oh, it looks like you guys need some help. Maybe I can help you guys get inside the White House. Wait, who the hell was that? Oh, don't tell me. Is that who I think it is? Holy shit. How are we supposed to get past all that? This is ridiculous. Look at him doing all of this just to take out the big D Don. I'll admit, that stupid idiot is smarter than I thought. Don't worry, fellas. I brought my dear Lexi. She can take on this whole army no problem. It's true. I even brought my favorite Chinese bazooka just for this special occasion. Did someone say China? No, no, no. Liza and Lexi. These are our citizens you're talking about. What kind of leaders would we be if we let you gun them down? Oh, come on, Obama. This is the easier way. Your girl loves violence, and I'm about to prove that no one can contain the almighty Liza. Ha ha ha! Stop it, Liza. Stop it. We're going to find another way. And how exactly are we going to find a way to get in there? Greetings, Presidents. Looks like you guys need some assistance. Maybe I can lend you a hand in this conundrum. Wait, who the hell was that? Oh, don't tell me. Is that who I think it is? Yes, it is I, Ben Shapiro. Believe it or not, but I also want to see Dark Brandon get taken down. Ben Shapiro? What kind of beef do you have with Dark Brandon? Believe it or not, I actually somewhat assisted Dark Brandon on this project of his. But I wasn't expecting him to take it this far. Wait, so you used to work for Dark Brandon? Oh, hell to the no! How do we know you're not trying to lure us into a trap? Before you make any assumptions, I'm no longer affiliated with Dark Brandon. You see, that bastard kicked me out of the project last minute and stole all the data I provided him with. Plus, this was before he transitioned. That's true. And quite honestly, I don't think you're a threat. But why exactly do you want to take down Dark Brandon? Well, let's just say I was promised a very valuable prize. But unfortunately, I was scammed. 
And now I want that stupid bastard to pay for trying to pull a fast one on me. And what exactly was this prize you were promised? Well, uh, you see, uh, that's not important. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah, nah! You're telling us or Lexi will gun you down. All right, all right. Please don't shoot me. The truth is, he promised me I would get to meet my favorite waifus. Your favorite waifus? Jesus Christ, Ben, I didn't know you were that down bad. <laughs> You're telling me you actually bought into that? Ah, oh, what a nerd. Let's just say, hypothetically, anime girls get me all bricked up. Ah, ha, 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 wink, wink. Plus, I don't want to hear it from you, Obunga. You literally simp for Daisy LMAO. But that's besides the point. Look, it will all make sense once we get in there. We just need to get in there first. All right, well, how exactly are we going to get in there? It's swarmed with armed American troops, and I'm not about to gun down my own people. That's where you're wrong, Abunga. If you look closely, they're not actual American troops. They're cognitive troops that were created by Dark Brandon. Those aren't the real U.S. citizens that you know. So taking them down won't actually harm any real citizens. So you're saying that killing these troops won't have any effect on any real troop? Precisely. These are just cognitive henchmen that Dark Brandon created to protect the White House. They're not actual humans. That's perfect, then. Lexi should be able to take down these monsters, no problem. It's true. I even brought my favorite Chinese bazooka just for this special occasion. Nah, nah, nah. Y'all get enough of the spotlight. Let the big D Donald J. Trump handle this. And what, what exactly do you plan on doing, Donald? Oh, you'll see Obama. No lady can resist the big D, especially when I put this baby on. Donald, I can confidently say that a bunch of ladies can resist the little D, and what are you putting on your head? Ha 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 ha, what is good in the hood, my G's? Donald, you've got to be kidding me! Why on earth did you bring that with you? You already know how it goes, Abamna. Direct Donald, don't play in this crib, young fella. Why am I friends with you? Don't worry, pussies, I'll be back! Uh, Mr. Trump, wait, they're very dangerous, please be careful. Yo, 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 for shizzle little ladies. Or should I say, oh, what's up, my nigga? What the hell did this orange man just call us? Trump, you frickin' bastard! I know you did not just say that! Calm your titties, Obama mama. It's all good, because as long as I wear this, I get a free pass from your people. I mean, who's gonna stop me anyways, am I right? Uh, what the hell did you just say? Oh shit, uh, wait. It, it's not what you think. <laughs> nah, nah, nah! Shut your fat lips, you piece of bacon. Hey! Is this man bothering you lovely ladies? Uh, yes. This orange ball sack called us the N-word and said he hates black people. Oh, hell no. That's it. I've had it with you. Wait, I did not say that last part. She's lying. I absolutely love my African Americans. I think they're great. Very great. Nah, nah, nah. Bring me that orange ass. Jesus Christ! Donald is such a moron! Can we just get this over with? Me and Lexi are dying to get our hands dirty. Ha 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 ha! That won't be necessary! Wait, who was that? Was that Carijo? Ha ha ha! Y'all didn't think you can just finish this female Biden arc without the home dog Carijo now, did you? Why am I even here? I could care less about this weird f batty Biden stuff. I was literally in the middle of my afternoon nap. Oh, come on, Yenna, show some more enthusiasm. We're here to save the world. Or, well, Batty Biden, at least. And how exactly are you two clowns going to help us get in there? Don't worry, Miss President. I've dealt with this type of stuff plenty of times. Trust me on this. I can handle this. Yo, yo, yo. What is up, my home dogs? Stop there right now. State your business here. Ain't no way they just walked up in the middle of the war zone. They're going to get killed. State your business now or we will be forced to eliminate you with brute force. Uh, Kirijo, are you sure about this? Don't worry, just follow my lead. Yo, 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 my name is Kirijo. <clears throat> Ain't no way he's about to start rapping. Hey, I said. Yo, 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 my name is Kirijo. Yeah, we're gonna die, aren't we? Well, it was fun while it lasted. Wait a minute, do my ass cheeks deceive me? Ain't no way, is that the home dog Kirijo himself? You're damn right it is! Ha ha ha! And I must say, Sabrina, you're looking sexier than usual. Did you get your hair done recently? Oh my, Kirijo, you're such a sweetheart. I'm so glad you noticed. You know what? You can go right on ahead. I'm sure the Master will be happy to see you. I know I sure am. What the hell is even happening? Woohoo! Let's go, Master Kirijo! Alright, Kirijo. 
I'll admit that was kind of impressive, but weren't we supposed to help the presidents get in? Oh, wait! We were supposed to help them? Oh, I thought we were having a contest to see who can get in the White House first. Kirijo, you're such an idiot. Well, what do we do now? Should we go back and get them? Nah, who cares? Let's go inside and see if they got any cool amiibos in there. On second thought, there was something I forgot to mention. Just give me a sec. I'll be back. Those idiots didn't even help us get in. Now what do we do? Oh wait, look. Kirijo is coming back. Maybe he's here to get us. Hey, Sabrina. There was something I almost forgot to tell you. You see, in case you were wondering, the presidents are actually hiding behind that bush right over there. Fuck you, Kirijo, you little shit! Thank you for the heads up, Kiriho. Ladies, fire. For fuck's sake, now what are we supposed to do? I've had enough of this stupid bullshit. If it's a gunfight they want, then we'll give them a gunfight. Come on, Lexi, get the nukes ready. You got it, Miss President, let's do this. Take this, pussies! Ah! <laughs> Careful, Liza, they're calling in backup. All right, Lexi, hurry it up. It's now or never. No worries, my lady, I'm about to send these bitches six feet under. Ha 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 ha! Chop Shibata Kobe! Oh, hell nah! Y'all aren't about to have all the fun without the one and only Jobama. Wait here, Benny. Wait, Obama, where are you going? Eight trigrams, 64 palms. Jobama. <laughs> no one can stop the job of Minator. Come on, guys, the coast is clear. Holy, she's a Jobama. That was really cool. Anyways, let's head in quickly. Oh, wait, where's Donald? Don't worry, guys. I will go get the orange man. Y'all go on ahead without us. Thanks, Lexi, but make it quick, please. All right, let's go get Big Chungus, shall we? Uh, hello, mister. Um, can I please have my orange friend back? You mean this big-ass Goomba right here? Yeah. Let me just get one last hit in real quick. Ah! All right. I'm done now. You can have him. Just make sure this jackass doesn't use any more foul language. No problem, sir. Oh, and I must say, you have an amazing physique. Have you been hitting the gym recently? Oh my god. Someone finally noticed? Yeah, I just surpassed my PR recently. Oh, don't tell me. Are you a gym head too? Of course I am. I'll have you know, my PR is at 700 right now. Though, I feel like I could definitely lift more. Hell yeah, that's my dog. Just for that, I'm willing to give you a free pass. Wink, wink. Oh, that won't be necessary. I'm not interested in using that word, but there is something you can help me with. Oh yeah? And what would that be? I thought you said Brandon was here? I swear, Ben, if you're tricking us, I will. Don't worry, Obamna. Dark Brandon is indeed here. It's just not where you'd expect. Just give me a sec. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the hell is this? I don't remember this being a part of the White House. Remember, Barack, this isn't the actual White House you know. It is a cognitive replica that's been created by Dark Brandon. With that said, this door right here should lead us to Dark Brandon. But it may not be what you expect. I can explain more on the way there. Please follow me. All right, Ben, I'm trusting you on this. Stay ready, Liza. Whoa, where the hell are we? This right here is the secret vault where Dark Brandon's big project takes place. Actually, before we continue, I'd like to give a shout out to some more kings and queens. Ha ha ha! No offense, but is now a good time to be giving shout outs? Shut up, Obama. It's always a good time to give shout outs. Ha ha ha! Shout out to Green Glitch 64, Tony Nico, Meaty Rex, Purple Heart. Oh, and Big Panda Boy for becoming true kings and queens. Ha ha ha, let's go. You know what, for becoming members, I'll have my lovely wife bake some delicious cookies for you guys. Ain't nobody want no burnt cookies from the man with the plan. Fuck you, Liza. All right, settle down, guys. We're almost there. So now that we're here, what exactly is this big project that you keep talking about, Ben? Let's just say this was hypothetically supposed to be a VR project. 
virtual reality, if you will. But Brandon took it way too far. And what exactly do you mean too far? Trust me, you'll see in just a moment. Holy black Santa ass cheeks. What on earth is this thing? What you're looking at is known as Project Tranquility Lane, a simulation created by Dark Brandon. Ben, this is insane. I thought you said it was just meant to be VR. It was supposed to be just VR. The original plan was to make a virtual reality type simulator that would take you to your favorite video game, which is why I helped with the project, because I thought it would bring me closer to meeting my favorite waifus. But one day Brandon came up to me looking like a girl, and then he just suddenly stole all the data and kicked me out of the project. I had no idea it would all turn into this. So this was his plan after all. He just wanted to trap himself in a simulation so he can stay as a little girl. So you're saying Sleepy Joe is in one of these pods as we speak? Can't we just break him out and call it a day? Unfortunately, these pods are indestructible. No matter what you do, they cannot break. If they can't break, then how are we supposed to free Joe from this nightmare? There's only one option. You guys have to enter the simulator. What the hell was that goofy ass noise? Hey, Yenna, look, I found this really cool soundboard. Watch, listen to this. Kirijo, stop touching that before you break something. You're expecting us to go inside these pods. And what do we do if we get stuck inside? Look, I know it's risky, but it's the only way to get that sleepy fossil back. If you don't, then Joe and Brandon will be trapped in there forever. If entering this simulator will get us our sleepy president back, then I'm in. Come on, Liza, there's no way we can just leave Joe in there. Even though Joey is a senile ball sack who should honestly be in jail for his awful takes, I'll admit he doesn't deserve this. Tell us what we need to do, Ben. If my calculations are correct, there should be a failsafe inside there. Once you find it, you'll be able to shut down the whole simulation. There's just one problem. Dark Brandon changed the whole simulator after he kicked me out, so I don't know where the failsafe is. Okay, and you're you sure that doing this will put a stop here. to this Shut whole the fuck up, Barack. I'm not done talking just yet. Anyways, as I was saying, there's just one problem. Dark Brandon changed the whole simulator after he kicked me out, so I don't know where the failsafe is. You guys will have to locate it yourselves. Okay, and you're sure that doing this will put a stop to this whole thing? Precisely. That failsafe is the only thing keeping this project alive. You see, Joe and Brandon may be the same person, but this simulator has separated them into two different bodies. So as long as you can find Joe and get him out of there, then Dark Brandon will no longer have control over him. Okay. I think I understand what's at stake here, but how can we trust that you're not just trying to trap us in here? Oh, there's no need to worry about that, my lady. Me and my new friend over here will keep an eye on Ben and make sure he doesn't try to pull any funny business. Oh, shoot, Donald. You're actually alive? LMAO, not gonna lie. I thought you died out there. Ah ha 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 ha. Man, that's crazy. I was literally out there getting my cheeks clapped by some big black guy, and y'all didn't try helping me? Honestly, Donald, you didn't deserve any help after you used the N-word without the pass. Man, y'all are just a bunch of fake news. Fake news, I tell you. Anyways, are we hopping in this stupid simulation or what? Yes, whenever you guys are ready, just hop inside the pods and you should be good to go. Oh, by the way, Mr. Shapiro, you're going to have to rub my feet while they're in there. You got it? Uh, y yes, you got it, sir. I will rub those feet to the best of my abilities. All right, you geezers. Let's go get that demented fossil and bring him back home. Good luck, my lady. I will be sure to prepare a nice dinner for you when you come back. Hell yeah. Let's do this, guys. Oh boy, I guess this is it. Wish us luck, kings and queens. It looks like we went 100 years back in time. Not gonna lie, this place looks just as old as Joe, and that's saying something. So this is Dark Brandon's simulation, huh? Interesting, I'll say that. What are we even supposed to do now? I'm lost. 
Hey there, sport. All the shite. Beautiful day, isn't it? Say, you should go talk to Betty. She's waiting for you over on the playground. Have fun, sport. Wait, who's Betty? Jesus Christ, what is wrong with you? Why would you sneak up on me like that? Liza, stop. He's literally just trying to help us. Nah, just for that, you're gonna get a knuckle sandwich! Yeah, you tell him, Liza. Help! Ha ha ha, that will teach him to never mess with the almighty Liza. Ah ha ha! Liza, stop! He's literally just trying to help us. What is wrong with you? Yeah, not gonna lie, I think Liza was in the right for that. That man was just a bunch of fake news, let me tell you. Jesus Christ. We haven't even been here for a minute, and y'all are already going insane. Look, let's just look for this Betty girl. Ah, this is a cute little doggy. Is it just me, or does this dog smell like a bunch of crack? Yeah, they do kind of smell like shite, but they're still cute. Honestly, the dog does kind of smell, but maybe it just uh, took I a guess dump. It was nothing. Anyways, let's talk to this girl here. Uh, hello, ma'am. Would you be able to help us Hi with there. something? Oh, someone new to play with. What good luck I have lately. I was just starting to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Um, yeah, sure. Uh, so, we're looking for an old guy. Goes by Batty Biden. Have you seen him? Gee, I don't know. What's he like? He kind of looks like Toadsworth, and he likes smelling hair. He's also riddled with dementia. And he likes rigging elections, if that helps. Hell, you might be his type, LMAO. And he's new here, too, isn't he? Oh, boy. He's your daddy, huh? Wait, I what? No I idea. never said he was my daddy. That makes this even more fun. Let's play. Oh, we're going to play all right. We're going to play who can catch these big D hands first. Donald, calm down. It was just a joke. Well, I hope it was worth being a comedian, because I'm about to kick her ass. Ain't nobody scared of you, Trumpy. Anyways, let's just go along with it. Maybe she can help. All right, Betty. We'll play a game with you. Betty, I said we'll play with you. Betty, answer me, damn it. I knew you would. Jesus it's Christ. It's a really simple game. All you have to do is make Timmy Newsbum cry. Wait, what? Wait, why would we make someone cry? What did Timmy even do? What kind of game is this, Betty? It'll be funny. Come on, you'll see. Make him cry and then come back here. And we'll talk some more. What? Why would we even do this? As much as I hate this girl, I'll admit it does sound kind of funny. Ah ha ha ha. Yeah, it does kind of sound funny. Ah ha ha ha. Jeez, this simulation is turning you guys into monsters. Fine, whatever. As long as it helps us get Joe back. So where is this Timmy kid anyways? I think he's at this lemonade stand right here. Five cents for lemonade? What the hell? This kid is literally robbing people. What? It's literally just five cents? That's nothing. Now, Liza, you don't get it. Five cents in this time is like a small loan of a million dollars. Donald, that's not even true. Don't worry, guys. I'll handle this. Yo, what's up, pussy? Hi there. I'm Timmy. Wanna play? Not really. Wait, maybe we can get some info off of him. Hey, Timmy, what do you think of this place? It's okay, I guess. I don't really have nobody to play with, except for Betty. And she's kind of, well... She's mean. Look, Timmy, let the Don give you a reality check. You see, none of this is real. It's all just a stupid simulation. Believe me, don't let the fake news media tell you otherwise. What? You're weird. Did you just call me weird? Oh, hell no. I'm not about to let some pussy disrespect me. Wait, Don, I don't think he... Hey, Timmy, listen here. Your parents are getting a divorce because of you. What? Did I do something bad? Yeah, and you know what? They never even loved you. They said they hate you. They actually said they wish that Donald J. Trump was their son instead, believe me. Jesus Christ, Donald! No, no! Not my mommy and daddy, no! No, no! <laughs> and you know what? This is my lemonade stand now. Ha ha ha. Screw your piss water. Donald, what is wrong with you? Why would you say that to him? Look, Betty told us to make him cry, and that's exactly what I did. No! No! I swear this kid is weird. Jeez, this simulation is turning you guys into monsters. 
Trump is already normally a dick, so I don't know what you were expecting Obama. Liza, you acting like you don't just insult people 24-7, but fuck me, I guess, right? Anyways, let's just go talk you to Betty. You won the game. Hey, bitch, I did what you wanted. Yay, I knew you could do it. Perhaps not the most inventive approach, but persuasion can be quite powerful. Wait, what the fuck? And for winning the game, you get a prize. You get to ask one question and receive an honest answer. I know I'm not the only one who heard that, right? Looks like the idiot just gave himself away. Ha ha ha. The jig is up, Brandon. We know it's you. I knew it. You were Brandon the whole time. What is this? What is this whole simulation of yours? Tranquility Lane is a simulation, a reality designed to play home to the denizens of Vault 112. It was my last and greatest project. I'm quite grateful that I was placed directly in charge of it. There have been unexpected benefits to living here. Now this dude is weird. You're lying. You stole this project from Ben. That's true. And also, what exactly do you mean benefits from living here? Uh-uh-uh. That's another question. And you've already had your answer for now. If you want more, you'll have to prove you're worth my time. Continue to amuse me, and I may answer more questions. Brandon, you're such a freaking brat. Fine, whatever. What do you want us to do? Pay a visit to the Rockwells. They're very happily married, and I'd like you to change that. Put an end to their marriage, and we'll talk. Why do you want us to end a marriage? You're such a weirdo, Brandon! For real, these requests are so random? But fine, we'll do it. But it's only because we want more answers from you. Rationalize it any way you'd like. If you succeed, we'll continue our discussion. Now, but for real, though, that little voice switch-up you keep doing is cursed and ugly as hell, Brandon. Oh, boy, I swear you're seriously about to make me act up Brandon! Ooh! What the fuck is wrong with you, Donald? That last part just sounded zesty as hell. But yeah, I agree, Brandon is ugly! Oh, yeah! L-M-F-A-O, nah, I'm starting to think y'all are more senile than Joe. Alright, this should be the house, Hello. the Rockwells. All right, guys, I think I'll handle this one. No offense, Barrick, but I think I'd rather have Liza take this one. What? Why? You don't think I can handle it? Well, <laughs> Holy shite! You scared me while- ah! <laughs> Obama, you're not making this better. Shut up! <laughs> the fuck was that? Did you just shit yourself? Well, I definitely feel something going down my legs. Haha, <laughs> L-M-A-O. Anyways, I'll handle this one, fellas. Hey there, little lady. How's it going? Oh, it's going fantastic, you fugly piece of shit! Yahoo! <laughs> what can you tell me about this neighborhood? Heck of a place to live. Janet and I, well, we're quite happy here. Yeah, I bet. Uh, anyways, can you tell me about your marriage? Now see here. That's not anything for you to be asking about. Our marriage is our business and it's private. Why can't people just understand that and just leave us alone? Oh, hell to the no! I know you're not talking to me like that! Who do you think you are? Liza, I think you're taking this a little- No, I'm not! This dick face will pay for giving me that attitude! Bye-bye. Where the hell is Janet? Oh ho, there you are, Janet! Oh boy, we got some things to discuss! Liza, please don't do anything crazy. Shut up, Obama! I'll do whatever I want. Well, hi there. Tell me about your marriage. Our marriage? Oh, goodness, what kind of a question is that? Mabel didn't put you up to this, did she? What a silly thing to ask about. Liza, please don't do anything crazy. All right, listen here. I hate to break it to you, but I saw your husband making out with Donald earlier. What the hell? Fake news. That's fake news. It's, it's that Martha <laughs> Simpson, isn't it? No, I said I it was Trump. It. That's it. I've had enough of Roger's lies and bullshit. Liza, you idiot. Why did you say me? You could have said Barrack at least. Sorry, Don Don, but this is for the sake of Sloppy Joe. Ha ha ha! In your face, Robert, you bitch! Roger, you son of a bitch. Holy frick! Did you really She's really you going at him! Find out? You? You ah! are You're not supposed for to be here. For fuck's sake! Why does it's everyone in this neighborhood keep sneaking up on us? It needs to end. The suffering must end. 
What the hell is this ancient relic even yammering about? And why did she just randomly break into someone else's home? I think that's the least of our worries right now. In fact, maybe this lady might be able to help us. Uh, hello. Um, do you happen to know what's going on? We're not really here. We're not really talking. It's all made up. Make believe. We're sleeping, dreaming. The dream became a nightmare. Oh, my God. It has to end. It just has to. But we're not in charge. He is. And he doesn't want us to wake up. Oh, my God. There's actually someone here who knows what's going on. You're talking about Brandon, right? He calls himself Betty now, but he's still the same. He can put on a new face all he likes, but underneath he's still evil. Braun. Bastard thinks because he helped create this place he's God here. But I know he still uses the fail-safe terminal. I know it. Did you just say fail-safe? Oh my God! Do you guys know what this means? Yeah, not gonna lie, I didn't think people of your color would be welcomed in this neighborhood, but I guess I was wrong. I'm not talking about her skin color, you dumbass. I'm talking about the fail-safe. She might know where the fail-safe is. Wait, something seems off to me. How come you're the only one who seems to know what's going on? Don't know. Can't sleep sometimes. Hear voices. My own skin doesn't feel right. None of this is right. You've got to believe me. You've got to find that fail-safe. And where can we find this fail-safe, ma'am? It's in the abandoned house. He doesn't want us going in there because he's afraid we might find it. It's the only terminal to the outside. The only way to shut the whole thing down. You've got to find it. We got our answer, guys. Wait, Let's go. Wait, shut up, Barack! Watch Don't this! Don't you <laughs> lie to me. Did you honestly think you could skulk around with that whore and no one Are you seeing this you? old lady, Dithers? Janet, what the hell are you talking about? Well, someone saw... Crazy, you right? Roger, and I heard about it. So now I know for sure. Who told you that? They're lying, I swear it. Facts! You it's fucking coward. Has I can't stand the sight of you. Get away from me. Ah in your face, Robert! And now, one last middle finger to send you off, pussy. Ah. 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 Yeah. Don't mess with me again! Knock it off, Liza. You proved your point already. Let's just head for the abandoned house now. Hold your horses, Obunga. We don't want Brandon to become suspicious of us. Let's talk to him first and see what else he has in store for us. Shut your goofy ass up, Obama. Wait a minute, I just thought of something. What if old lady Dithers was supposed to be Sleepy Joe? Uh, you know what? You might be onto something. That would explain why she was just as wrinkly as my left nutsack. Ha ha. TMI, you nasty. That's an interesting theory, but I'm pretty sure Joe would have told us if that was him. How about we ask this cute doggy instead? Hello, Doge. Do you know where Batty Biden is? The mutt doesn't know anything, hell. This might be Commander we're talking to, and that mutt can go take a hike. Would it kill you to be polite for once, Donnie? I am polite, Obunga. Some may say I'm the most polite person they've ever met. Believe me. Plus, I know I'm not the only one who can smell that awful odor from this dog. Yeah, that's true. Not gonna lie. This dog smells like one of Joe's used diapers. Must be a coincidence. Ha ha. How would you know what that smells like? Let's just talk to Brandon already. Hey, idiot, we did what you wanted. Poor Janet and Roger. So, you have achieved your goal. I was hoping for something a bit more dramatic, but persuasion appears to be your strong suit. All right, Brandon, cut it out. We did what you wanted. So now you got some explaining to do. You have amused me thus far, but I still don't think you're quite in a position to be demanding anything. Still, I suppose you've earned the right to some further answers. What would you ask of me? Enough of the mind games, Brandon. Where is Joe? Just tell us where he is already. He's here, and he is unharmed. He has merely been rendered unable to bother me. Cut the crap, you senile predator, and just tell us where he is. If you continue to behave and do as I ask, I may be willing to release both of you. But first, you have work to do. For crying out loud, you're such a headache. Why are we even doing these random requests anyways? On Sleepy Joe, 
If we were in the real world, I would have knocked your dumb ass out by now. Fine, whatever. Let's just get this over with already. Oh, come now. Show some enthusiasm. There are fewer rules this time. I'd like to see just what you're capable of. I'd like you to kill Mabel Henderson. What? Please put some effort into it. Do something creative. Beating her to death won't impress me. What? What? There's no way I'm going to murder an innocent woman. What is wrong with you, Brandon? Seems like we don't have a choice, Barack. Fine, we'll do your stupid task. Of course you will. And you never know. You might enjoy it. Now, but for real, though, that little voice switch up you keep doing is cursed and ugly as hell, Brandon. Guys, there's no way I'm killing someone. This is insane. Come on, Barack, just follow us. All right, there's no way he'll see us from here. Well, he might see Donald's big ass. Oh, piss off. Guys, there's no way I'm killing someone. This is insane. Calm down. We're not going to murder her. We're going to head to the abandoned house to look for that failsafe. But we haven't found Joe yet. Shouldn't we look for him first? That bastard is fine. Brandon said it himself. He's fine. We'll activate the failsafe, and then we'll force that idiot to give us JoJo. Well, I guess that's only option here. Okay, let's do it. I'm pretty sure this is the abandoned house. Can't be that bad, right? Hey, try not to poop yourself. <laughs> shut up before I rip that dumbass wig off your head. All right, guys, shut up. Let's just hurry this up. I know it's abandoned, but I, I did, didn't know it would look this creepy. Let's just hurry this up. Bruh, I can barely see. It's too dark in here. Ah! Whoa! Ah, ha, 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 ha. Those pants look a bit soiled, Dumpy. Curse you, Liza. I just bought these pants. It's not in here. Hello? Is anyone home? What does a failsafe even look like? Jeez, this is too difficult. Aside from that awful smell coming from Trump's trousers, it seems like nothing is here. What's with this random junk everywhere? Maybe it's somewhere hiding? Oh wait, did you guys hear that? Ooh, what if this is like some secret code or something? It made a noise. Maybe we're supposed to do something with these. Damn it! Way to go, genius! I don't see you doing anything. Wait, let me give it a try. <laughs> Holy shite! What is that thing? Oh my god, this must be the fail safe. We found it, guys. We actually found it. Let's hurry it up then. Let's activate that bitch as fast as possible. This just looks like a bunch of nerd stuff. I don't know what any of this means. <gasps> oh my god! Ooh! Whoa! Oh. Did someone say China? I have to have my China. 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 I have to have my China. Trump, calm your titties down. Oh, please, Obunga. P.O.S. let me have my China. Calm the fuck down, you titty monster. We don't even know what Chinese invasion even means. Let's read a little more first. I don't know, man. It sounds like a bunch of real news to me. 
Man, I gotta post this on Truth Social. What does a Chinese invasion even mean? Here is the revised code for the- Obama! You damn well, we don't got time to read all this. Let's just go for it. I agree with the booby girl. <laughs> Let's press the big red button. <laughs> Fine, whatever. Oh boy, I really hope this puts an end to everything. All right, we did it. Now what happens? Let's go see the mess this booby monster caused. Oh, I can't wait to see. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Holy shite! What is going on? What the fuck just happened to you, Obama? Yes, yes, yes. This beautiful. Free the people, my Chinese spies. Screw the fake news media. Holy shite, they're really going at this, citizens. Oh yes, yeah, snipe their asses into Narnia. Trump, what is wrong with you? I didn't know this would happen. Oh, stop, Mommy Bama. These people were bound to kick the bucket anyways. Oh no! Is that old lady dithers? No! They shot down old lady dithers! Go cry about it, Obama. That bat was way past her expiration date anyway. Damn! They really gangbanged these citizens LMFAO! What is wrong with you soldiers? I don't even know what they are saying. They're probably saying, oh my Mr. Trump, you are truly the most sexiest man we've ever seen, believe me. You know what? All this violence is making me want to get my licks into. Take this! Ah, ha, 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 ha. Kiss my ass, you Chinese spy. No, Ichi. Oh, no, goddammit. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, yo, good stuff, Liza. You knocked his goofy odd out. Oh, thank God. They didn't shoot the doggy. I was worried they would have hurt him, too. True. But isn't it a little odd that the dog is the only one they didn't target? It's probably because this dog smells like a pile of horse shite. They probably didn't want to go anywhere near him. Must be a coincidence. Oh, well, let's go flex in Brandon's face. <laughs> Do you realize what you've done? You've triggered the failsafe, ruined everything. The subjects will die, and I'll be stuck here in this hell alone. You ruined everything. Everything! <laughs> Screw you, Brandon! We're calling the shots around here now! <laughs> you? No, I! I am the creator of this world! The jig is up, Dark Brandon! We've destroyed your simulation! <laughs> now tell us where Sleepy Joe is right now! He's been right here the whole time. And you were too dense to figure it out. The dog, you see. Man's best friend. But now you've taken all my friends from me. Wait, you're telling me Joe Biden was the dog the whole time? Oh, you know what? That would explain why the dog smelled like a bunch of piss and crack. That's not the point. The point is Joe is safe. <laughs> Wait, so does that mean we can leave now? Isn't it obvious? You've run the failsafe, disrupted everything. I have no power over you. There's the door. Go. Oh, stop trying to play victim, Brandon. You're evil and you got exactly what you deserved. <laughs> Come on, guys, we're out this hoe. Run along now. Let's go, do you hear that, Joe? We won, we can finally leave this hell. Damn it, Joe, you have no idea how much trouble you caused us. I can't wait to kick your wrinkly ass when we get home. Oh, oh, wait, before we go, I wanna do one more thing. <clears throat> Yard! All right, come on, Jojo. Let's get out of here. Oh my God, I can't believe it. You guys actually saved me. Man, I'll admit, being one with the little girls was cool, but I think I prefer my Chad-like dashing good looks instead. Am I right, Barack? Ooh, yeah, sure, Joe, whatever you say. Look, I'm just glad to have you back, homie. Me too, man. Uh, hey, who's this purple-haired girl? Is she like your sister or something? Jesus Christ, to think it hasn't even been a minute yet and your dementia has already kicked in. Damn it, Joe, you have no idea how much trouble you caused us. I can't wait to kick your wrinkly ass when we get home. Well, bring it on, Tubby. You ain't ready for these hands, buddy. Hey, wait! Where's Lexi? I thought they were waiting for us. They were, but they ended up leaving after like 10 minutes. 
They ended up getting bored, so they said they were going to go wait at McDonald's. Hey, wait. They went to McDonald's without me? Oh, hell no. I'm going to give that maid a piece of my mind. Are you talking about Lexi? Hey, Donald, get back here. You better not do anything to Lexi. I swear y'all are stupid as hell. Ha 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 ha. Anyways, are you coming, Joey, or what? Yeah, sure, I'll tag along. Man, I'm starving. You better pay for my meal, Obama. Pay for your meal? Bruh, I literally just saved your life. You're paying for me. Damn it, Barack, don't make me summon Brandon again. LMFAO. That would be crazy, imagine. Ah ha ha ha, now that everyone is gone. Now I can finally continue my project on finally meeting my sexy waifus. Ah ha 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 ha. Ah ha 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 Guys, I got his ass! Back shit up your kubashitaki wapi shit kiki wa hey!